Risk reduction surgery is the ability to prevent cancer before you get it. And the problem with ovarian cancer is there is no effective screening for ovarian cancer. And I'll say it again, no effective screening. There's no mammogram for ovarian cancer. There's no pap smear. There's no colonoscopy equivalent. It's a disease that springs literally from the fallopian tubes and spreads very rapidly on an order of three to four months. And that's why we have not been able to effectively screen for ovarian cancer. So how do you deal with it? You prevent it. So one of the newer things we've been doing is actually removing just the fallopian tubes in younger women that want to have risk reduction surgery. It's a relatively new concept. It was just endorsed by the SGO this past year, but it's a great option for young women that are not ready to have their ovaries removed, deal with hormonal issues, but still do something to reduce the risk of getting ovarian cancer. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I want to share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.